Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are at our local spot and we are expecting quite a bit of wind. We do have a squall on the forecast coming, so we are gonna be keeping an eye on that. So right now the wind isn't crazy strong. It's about 14 to 16 knots. So I'm gonna take this opportunity to practice some tricks before everyone else shows up and before the wind really picks up. Once we get some nice, nice boosting wind, that's what we're gonna be focusing on is jumping really high. So yeah, let's get to it. enjoying the rain from the comfort of outside, but I prefer to be inside when there's that much lightning. As our friends were having fun outside, the wind speed briefly picked up to over 40 knots at our beach. Luckily, by that point, everyone was off the water due to an emergency alert sent to our cell phones warning us of tornadoes. This was the first time ever that we received this type of an alert, and it worked, as kiters on the beach waved everyone in. Unfortunately, one of our friends riding at a different beach up wind of us got stuck in a squall, but he managed to pull the safety in time and self-rescue to shore. As we later learned, there were six confirmed tornadoes and one water spout associated with that storm. We waited at the storm, and now the wind has picked back up. It looks like it's eight meter weather, so we're gonna go kite. asked fairly often is why we prefer foil kites. One reason is that they seem to handle lulls better in our opinion. As you can see here, the wind was dropping and while a couple of guys with inflatables ended up swimming, both Nicholas and I were able to keep our kites in the air, make it back to shore, and land. So I launched the 8. Unfortunately it just wasn't enough wind, it was a little bit underpowered. Um, and the wind didn't last incredibly long either, but I did have the opportunity to try the new surfer app, which was pretty cool. Pretty nice to see your jump height right on your board immediately after. Um, so I will definitely be using that again in the future. 
Um, but yeah, wind died now, so we're gonna pack up, call it a day. And thank you so much for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.